hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Jonas, you're the man on the sticks. I have the sticks. And we're playing Mad 19, pretty girl. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that Madden 19 relocated franchise for the Toronto Mounties. Goddamn skip. As always, playing offense only, simming that. D. And uh, using that balance playbook. Simming it up. Simming it up. Should we transform Saquon Barkley into TNT Dynamite midseason? <laughs> what, what are you talking about? Like he morphs into another play. Do like, I look like a Saquon to you? Uh, no. I mean, if you if you want to, we could like guy. mid-season morph everyone into somebody else. I mean, yeah, in this dimension, people we can, can do whatever become, we want, man. People I'm, can we become are, whoever. We are God in this dimension. I don't want to be God, Joe. This has a lot of responsibility. You can be Allah, oh. Buddha, <laughs> whoever you want to be, dog. Josiah is really like? thought you were gonna go Mohammed, Jonas. I was like, you're gonna lose our Muslim demographic real quick if you say I could be Mohammed, man. <laughs> they don't go for that shit. <laughs> gonna get bombed. Dude, wow, the crazy town compound under under attack. <laughs> Please forgive our insolence. <laughs> we are infidels at our at the infidel dome. All right, let's see here. All right, we're gonna take Saquon off to the left. Do, do, do. Spin. Oh, God, right into the other boys. He's pretty strong, though. Yeah, Saquon's pretty good. He's like, he's a, he was a rookie in real life this year, and he he did very, very well. So, like, he's actually a really good player. Who did he play for again? The Giants. The Giants. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying but to think. they suck. Galladay's a real player. He plays for the Lions. But the Giants suck, don't they? Yeah, but, he, but Barkley's good. Um, and then the other three receivers that we use, they were all, we drafted all of them. Ricky Seals Jones, our tight end, is a real player. He plays for Arizona, maybe? Oh, so we got like a bunch of like actual. Yeah, because, players. okay, here's how I normally do these. Normally, I take a team that has a lot of like older players over 30, and I trade them and cut them all, and then I bring in a bunch of young guys. Yeah. But what happened is when I did the fantasy draft, it drafted a ton of young players so like there wasn't nearly as many guys to get rid of so that's why there's a lot uh, more real players on the team uh, I see. yeah we got a punt you cheated so that's why i tried to do something different because like um i cheated i guess Not really. um, it's fine <laughs> joe's been fiddling oh. with the code oh this son of a bitch yeah i rewrote the code Maybe I can fix it because Madden's not jank or anything. Are there any uh, any mods you can get for this game? I don't think EA does mod support. Though. Oh my god, we're down ten nothing, dude. Uh, um, yeah, but no, they, I mean shit. like on PC, you pro I mean obviously you can, but not on Xbox. No, the only games on Xbox that have mod support are uh, Skyrim and Fallout Four. That's it. So wait a minute though, since like uh, you did a fantasy, so that means all the other teams. Yeah, they're all random. Like, it's all the NFL players that were on the teams or were randomized and thrown on teams. Oh. Yeah. But I, there was one, I did one season and then we did an off season. So there's players that, like, every team drafted new players. Every team did an off season with, like, free agents. So the teams are very, like. You simulate a season? The first season. How, like, how I do all we, the time. How did we do? Uh, In our simulated first season. <laughs> I don't remember. You Normally don't remember if we really, did well or not? On the other rebuilds, we did really, really bad because I cut all the players, so everyone on the team was trash. So most of the time we won like two games or three games. I think we had the number one overall pick. I think we only won like four games or something. Okay. Yeah, we didn't do very well. Normally the first season is bad. Like we don't we don't do very well. Um, but hey, whatever, man. Fuck it. Toronto fucking Mounties, yeah, boys. There, there's Mount up. Other, there's only one other uh, foreign team we can be. It'd be the Dublin, Ireland. Figure out the insert there. Dude, I spun that dude around, and he still grabbed me like he, I was his fucking prom date. Well, you shouldn't have been looking so cute. <laughs> Absolutely. I have that problem every day. Everyone's just grabbing me and spinning me around like they're prom date. Uh, <laughs> Fucking, um, but if, yeah, the Dublin. Maybe maybe we'll do a Dublin franchise. We'll we'll get all the we'll get all the fucking out of country teams, and then maybe after we've done one full season or all, we'll just do a medley and just do random games from a team until as we go through. Sounds Jump, good with me. The Dosperados to the Golden Eagles. Whoa, to the, whoa! I don't even know these people. Yeah, Who they don't exist. Guys? Who are these guys? 
No, I, I think you're getting a little far ahead. We just like our <laughs> fucking first week with these guys. Yeah, but yeah, dude. But you know, we got a long way till Madden 20 comes out. Oh boy, do we? Yeah. Hopefully or they don't or, fuck or it maybe up. we'll just stop and we'll start another playthrough of a different game. And, but I'll keep. I'm keeping that Browns one going until Madden 20 comes out. I think. Then just gonna keep it. Start a new one Madden 20. No, my dude. rest of my life will be playing Brown Seasons. I, the the Madden content is is the, are the ones that get the clicks, man. We gotta keep that going. Yeah, absolutely, for sure. The other ones get clicks, dude. Why are we not winning? I can't do because anything. you're not getting scores. All right, I'm going for it. This I like, would hope so. This is a high risk play. I can see that. This can be very detrimental to the rest of our life. I don't want to lose to the Bills. Period. Ever. All right, so get some completions. I'm doing it right now. Think of the mighty moose, the gentle moose. Put down the horns! Oh my god, I flipped him over with my fucking Hillenmeyer gazelling around. He's happy. <laughs> yeah, as soon, Ooh, as, you, as, soon as you lower your antlers, man, there's nothing they can do. Yeah, but, but the Mounties don't have antlers. No, they have guns. <laughs> I brought up my gun, and he was like, oh shit. As soon as you chop them down with your beaver teeth. Wow, dude, my beaver teeth. Just chomping at the bite. Like, chomp it at the That's bite. What do, what do beavers even do, man? Beavers. They, um, they beef. They're herbivorous. Well, they're, what does her, that mean? They're herbivorous? Herbivorous? Herb oh, her, oh, herbivores. Yes, they're herbivorous. I got you, okay. So they don't, like, attack people. Can you remind me after this game to take Cowboy out of the fucking lineup? He keeps creeping back in. Just take him out now. Yeah, but it won't save. Like, if you make a change in game, uh, it doesn't, doesn't save, save after it. game, yeah. Well, switch it out anyway. I will do it. Um, so they the eat herbs. Um, yeah, they what? build dams. Oh. They smack shit with their tail, they, I believe. They, they need to smack the dams with their tails. That's, I think they pack the mud now. With oh, that. okay. All right. Beavers um, are weird, though. I mean, what do they do? You ever seen Zombievers on Netflix? No. Dude, it's I've, good. I feel like I've heard of it, It's though. really good. Zombievers. Like, it, okay. It's not very often that a cheesy horror movie, like... Fucking has a surprise that like I go that was genius that movie did it like the it literally beavers? it literally had a part oh my god dude it's forced down again why can't we do oh, anything no. their defense is Don't their knee that. is strong as fuck I'm going for it again you're gonna have to start concentrating I will we, we have too much talk <laughs> we have too much talk. You might have to concentrate on the game. Maybe a little bit. Um, Zombievers is quality, though. Right. I will recommend. Uh, I mean, it's oh. cheesy as fuck. It's not like a fucking Best Picture nominee. You didn't watch Bird Box, did you? I did. It was good. Really? Yeah, it was cool. I watched it, yeah. You did see I watched it before the meme started. Huh. Oh, my. Well. Wow. That guy didn't even look for the ball. It was literally thrown right to him. And he just, here we go. We're getting booed on our home oh, court. No, it's cool. We're good. Um, have you <laughs> no, watched? it's cool. We're have good. Have you watched it? No, dude. It was good. It was actually good. I was I surprised because Sandra Bullock movies usually aren't my thing, but oh, I, I love Sandy B. But I don't even have I don't even have Netflix. Oh, I got you. I'm a yeah, YouTube I mean, boy. You could watch it online. Oh, I could just like steal it. No, dude. You mean steal the, the I don't, data? I'm not down for stealing. Thank no. you. I just thought we were honest. I am. I'm an honest friend. <laughs> um, no, it's uh, it was good. It was pretty cool. I mean, it wasn't. I've never. I won't ever watch it again. But it was. Okay, so it wasn't amazing. It was better than Bright, though. Oh yeah, dude. I oh, see. And I liked Bright. Oh my God, did you see that? I did. Two men. You need and here this. comes fucking Usain Bolt. Oh look at the Star Boy. Dude, fucking why is Usain Bolt out here? I don't know. Who's, yeah, yeah. Who dude. are the Star Boys? Oh shit, Orange J into the block, BZ. What is, uh, what is who's the star boy on that team? I, that, I, he didn't have a star. I have no idea who fucking Usain Bolt was because he definitely not even, was. No, Usain no, Bolt not the dude that was catching to you. There's like a team on the enemy on on the defense. Oh, any who's, guy that has a star under their name is yeah. one of the team captains uh, for that team. So it could be it could vary. Like, but usually they're some of the best players. Like, uh, so if you see the guys with the stars, it's like oh shit. You know. Oh, so he's the he's the one of the better guys. Yeah, pretty much. Or like he's like it, it's not necessarily the better guys because like sometimes the kicker will be a captain. Oh my god, Rhett Freeman, Friedman, Friedman. All right, we gotta call timeout. The only way I take my man Fried. 
<laughs> yes. That's how I do it. Lathered in oil. Lathered, oiled, and fried with peanuts. Yep, it's, with a thin layer of Velveeta. Ooh, Velveeta is good, dude. No, it isn't. Dude, Velveeta dip is fucking oh bomb. Oh, my God, dude, Put a little bit of hamburger, sausage, fucking cream of mushroom soup. Dude, there's something about that man-made block of yellow cheese-flavored <laughs> oh my god, the surgeon's open. Ugh. Oh my god, he dissected him. You thought it was a day to replace oh your kidney. Oh no, my children. And it is a day to replace your kidney. <laughs> of course, it's a. It's always a good day to get your yeah, kidney dude. replaced. Oh, they gave us the ball back. Well, Our good. team stole it. Good shit. Yeah, we're gonna... They know their place. They do. When we fucking whoop whoop pull over, that ass is too fat. Yeah, dude, that's how I say it. <laughs> Trick me. No, no, Trick Daddy, Jonas. Trick Daddy? Is that, is that a trick name? Trick Daddy is my favorite trick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. They just killed Rhett. Well, he's dead now. Oh, oh he's yeah. seizing. He's, oh, my. He can't even get up. Oh, yeah. No, they cut away from that. He's Yeah, they don't want to show him die on the field. He was rumbling, bumbling, stumbling. Whoop, whoop, pull over that ass too fat. Sorry. <laughs> You don't know. How many songs can you write about a booty? About a thousand. <laughs> That's a T pain. That is about some T pain. He's talented. Oh, Ow. damn, dude. That's the Browns player again. They're all over he, you. Oh, he just fucking flexed on What? Him. <laughs> he stepped into your head. I, I did see that. That should be illegal. <laughs> you had ankle coming from your nose. <laughs> yeah, you know, wouldn't be the first time. Ankle Nose Johnson. Ankle Nose Johnson. That's actually his nickname. Antonio Ankle, Ankle Nose Johnson <laughs> Cowboy. <laughs> Ankle Nose. Oh, God. I wish somebody's name was Ankle Nose. All right. We got to get Saquon as 100. I know. I'm really glad that we've been wearing these these uniforms like the last three yeah, games. Yeah, dude. It's been a lot of like home games in a row. I know. I'm loving it, and though. We're gonna, pretty soon that's going to end. So... What do you mean it's going to end? I mean, because we're going to have an away game again. Oh, oh there it God. is. Oh, Jesus. Whew. Man, God. they were a little slow on the uptake there. Yeah, they were. That guy's fucking reflexes were not activated. Yeah, dude. Whew. Our coach looks like some guy who would take you out on his fishing boat. And then nothing, Jonas, that you would catch fish. Oh, he just looks like a fisherman. <laughs> I, mean, I guess he looks like the same oh, guy. That, that would oh have my a god, boat. dude! It literally just bounced off his neck. I mean, but we're winning now, so. Dude, but it's never enough. You never have to worry again. Once we have the lead, it's basically you know. I guess. Um, what do people do on fishing boats? Like, what did you mean by that? Like, what type of guy would take you on? You said our coach looks like the type of guy that would take you on his yeah, fishing boat. He looks like an old man who has a fishing boat. Oh my god! Blocky McBlockface concussed. Nah, he's good. He got right up. Look at him. Look at that neck. What? what <laughs> but why, does it, he like fish? He looks like he doesn't eat a lot of fish. Why? You don't look like you. you do you go fishing? You ever been fishing? I've been a few times, yes. I do like fishing. It's fun. I just don't have the opportunity. Oh, my God. You, so you don't know like what a typical fisherman guy would look like? He looks like the skipper from Gilligan's Island? Basically. Oh, okay. He's got a little skipper. <laughs> He's got a little skipper going on. He's just a little skipper, everybody. He's a little skipper. They don't make shit like Gilligan's Island anymore. Nah, dude. They don't, because no one would watch it. I was watching AVGN, and they were talking about Demolition Man. Oh, I love fucking Demolition Man. So, really? Holiday on a holiday. And somebody's hurt. Oh, and he goes. What is he doing? Dude, he's, he's dude, just Demolition having a good time. Man, I love that movie. Really? Yeah, dude. It's, it's not very good, but, it's, no. but I like it. And they were just talking about uh, how like that was like the height of the uh, the action film. And how you don't really see those being made anymore. No, you don't. Like The Rock tried to with that skyscraper movie, but it didn't. Oh, really. I didn't see that. Was it like I heard it was like an homage, kind of like to Die Hard, but yeah. like like I kind of want to see it because I Die Hard is like one of my all-time favorite movies. I love Die Hard a lot, and it's my favorite Christmas movie and one of my all-time. Oh my God! Jesus. There is a little bit of suspension of, of uh, disbelief you gotta have when you watch Die Hard or any of those. Oh action movies. yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. Terminator movies. Oh, dude, any of them. Like you gotta go in being like, everything that will never happen is gonna happen. Yeah. Like in T2, the guy drives a semi over a bridge into like a water reservoir, chasing a guy on a motor moped. You can do that. 
Yeah, if, <laughs> you you're, if you're a T-1000, I guess you can. You can do that, though. Yeah. So, yeah, I don't know. They don't really make movies like that anymore. I'm cool with it, though. Yeah. Because I they, love they, they comic They kind of ran its movies. course, man. Like, you can't. Like, there's no one this day and age who would be, like, an Arnold that would be a believable Arnold. Like, yeah, that's there's true. not. Like, that's true. And even, like, when they try to do, like, the Expendable movies, they're, all those guys are so old, they don't, it just doesn't work. Well, I mean, yeah, but they got, like, new guys now. I, like, the, the comic book movies are basically the new action that's, movies. That's true. But, like, even, like, Jason Statham, who had a, quite a few of those cheesy action movies, mm. he's not... He's not the... He ain't no Arnold, no. No, dude. He's, he's like... And even, like, Jet Li had a few for a while. Like, he, they tried to, like, incorporate, like, the kung fu and the action together. Mm. Oh, Galladay on a holiday, friends. I would go as far as to say as, like, the stars of the Marvel movies are not even as big as those guys are. Oh, I guess, dude. like, uh, Robert Downey Jr. would be, like, the closest thing. Yeah, but he's, he's, been he's pretty big. for 30 years yeah. in the movies, dude. He's a like, million years old. Yeah, dude. He can't... <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. It's just, I guess it's not. And, and you know what I think it causes that nowadays is that. Um, the kids won't put down their goddamn well, cell no, phones. Well, like, you can become famous, like, on the internet now. So, like, before, you were famous because you were in movies, and those people were fucking famous. Mm -hmm. Like, and now you can just, like, be a guy on YouTube and be, like, famous to your demographic or your niche but like not everybody watches big blockbuster movies anymore That's people don't true. care about that shit so it actually took some shine from the actual movie stars because now you have like a whole nother tier of, of stardom right and it's not like famous movie star it's yeah. famous youtuber famous twitch guy or whatever you got a good point and the there, people man. who watch movies don't give a fuck about twitch and the people who are big into movies don't really give them you know it's like it's vice versa it's i kind of like, get it there's only so much attention we can give right the the famous people quote unquote right and music <laughs> is different because like everyone listens to music so it's like but there's so much music that it's like you can be into soundcloud rappers and you don't care about the mainstream guys or you could be you know yeah, it helps to be a rapper though in music nowadays oh, it helps to get yeah. tattoos and name yourself a little something yeah dude it does a little something Dude, I saw this video. Really Have you seen? Uh, there was a uh, a new rap Whoa. girl who's like with Little Zan and whatever. Like some, she has like blue hair and You're shit. You're talking about motherfucking baby goth. But, Fuck but baby no, goth. But no, but listen. I talked about some, her in one of my videos. Some guy did a fucking debunk video. She's a plant from the <laughs> music industry. She's an industry plant. She is because, dude, he did this whole. I I, I got sucked into. It. I was like, what is this? But, like, she put out her own music under a different name and yeah, shit. And trash. then her first track has Lil Xan and Trippy Red in it. And, like, all this stuff. She supposedly it's her first ever song. And, like, they have pictures of her, like, without face tattoos. And this is all, like, within the last, like, eight months or something. Yeah. Like, they took her as from, like, a normal girl trying to get big on the internet and made her this it does edgy seem, it does seem SoundCloud kinda, rapper. I don't know. I don't know if I... Truly believe in the, in the whole plant, dude. Mechanic, watch this video. Like this kid, this kid was like he had to be like seventeen. He did this. He did, he's like I'm going crazy. I just like he cares way too much, obviously. But like it was interesting because like why? he's like, why did she come out of nowhere? And da, why, da, 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 da. why can't why can't she just have like a rich uncle or something? That's, I mean, I guess that's true too. Why couldn't she just like? Know but he did all the stuff like linking like. What who she signed to compared to who these guys are signed to, who's a parent company of it. He like he went way too deep in it. Yeah, I mean like I, I just don't understand like what's the point of her being and what is she? What she does, sells what out does, to get rich. What does baby goth do for the industry that makes it lucrative to the person oh, who sure plants her? I'm sure someone fucking uh she you know someone like yeah like she has a rich uncle or something that was like here I know a guy at Universal let's make you famous you know. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm saying. So what's an industry plant then? A person with enough money to buy, buy fame? their fame? Yeah, because the re <laughs> be no, no, because what? listen, no, because the record company gets rich off the persona. They become, they sell out who they are and become this persona instead. Yeah, Jonas, we've sold out ourselves. Are we industry plants? We are not. We have not sold out yet. <laughs> no. We're so close. Bro. No, dude. If Wait. someone came to us and said, "Hey, why don't you become Bronus and you become TNT fucking Dogamite and you talk about college humor constantly and talk about how you're bros and fucking you're frat and blah blah." How much does it pay? 
question. <laughs> <You're> like, <laughs> how much would it cost? You? No, how much does it pay? That's all I gotta ask. You're counting, I can Over 100k a year. Absolute Jonas, you I can sell out in a fucking heartbeat, dude. Because you're essentially just becoming a character. You're, it's not who you are outside of this. You know what I mean? Oh, and listen, to, you're even trying to like rationalize the sellout. Ooh, Ricky Seals Jones. You're trying to but rationalize. I don't blame people for selling out. Because, well, I mean, if you go all in and you start getting face tats and shit, like, yeah, yeah, I mean. Yeah. Jonas, if I guaranteed you 100K a year and all you had to do was get a face tat, you're telling me you wouldn't do it? Oh, I probably would. Okay, then, thank you. For how long, rest of my life? Well, I mean, it's a face tat, bro. No, no, no. How long do I make 100K for? I don't like, know. As long as you keep coming out with killer end content. Well, but who judges what's killer content? Yeah, That's the question. The public. Right, that, and the it, it public opinion that. can turn on you in a second, dude. Well, you've heard Baby Goth's music. Have I? Or song, I guess. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> and was it the most amazing song you've ever heard? Okay. No, none of that music is good. <laughs> like Lil Xan, <laughs> Trippy Red, all those guys. I mean, that's not you know, my thing. You know what's crazy is I actually have been listening to that Trippy Red album like a lot lately. Which one is like the newest, newest one you put one. out? Yeah, I don't know what it's fucking called. But it's got like a cartoon character on it. Yeah, I don't. It's I mean, kind of like a it, guilty pleasure. It's just not. My, yeah, it's like. So it's yeah, you like. I don't. I don't know why I like it, but I do. So I'm gonna listen to it. It's so, like. So you like you like Baby Goth? Huh? No, <laughs> no, not at all. You like Lil Xan? No, no. You I just Xan think anarchist, bro. I do. I just think it's interesting how these people just like. They're just like, nah, dude. I'm like 18. Let me tap my face and yeah. make rap and. And like all of a sudden they're fucking like millionaires. Hey, she I mean, makes, good for them, I guess. I don't know if she's necessarily making more money than us, but I can kind of guess she's I probably can, making dude, more. Money. She's probably making more money than us. Yeah, they probably paid her enough to get that face tat. She's making more money because she was she was on uh, she's on Trippy Red's album. I absolutely hate the song that she's on too. It's so bad, but she well, is on his album, and I think she's on Little Zan's album as well. So she's like, I don't know if she was a musician, and then they were like, all right, we're going to try to make well, no, you famous, but all you got to like, do is I'll give you the face. quick rundown. Like, this new video, he said, she she claims that she only has that one song, right? <laughs> the baby golf deep dive. But, but she had, but I guess he said she had, Um, he, he was like, here's what this guy said. He goes, she had these other music under some other name, and she was just a normal looking chick, oh and, the, and the songs only have like 3,000 listens or something, yeah. he said. And then all of a sudden, she puts out this one hit, and she's featured on trippy red's album she's featured on like it just doesn't make sense if her music wasn't blowing up why she got big i mean those two aren't exactly like super mega dude they're stars. pretty big right now. they're pretty big dude like i don't listen to them but i mean they're, but they're not big. super mega stars they're no, not as they're big not as drake or jay-z or anybody or none of those guys will ever be that big because eventually it's gonna run out man people are gonna get sick of it it's like it's like a niche it did the same thing that rock music did man it got a little too fucking crazy. <laughs> Everybody started doing it. Yep. It got too fucking crazy, and then people turned away from it and were like, you need something new. Right, and that's what's going to happen with all these guys, and they're all going to be face tatted up forever. So it's like... Face tat. I'm telling you, Jonas, in the future, face tats are going to be more common than you think. Oh, they already are. Dude. I would not like, be well, surprised I mean, if our future. Back in the day, you would, you, you'd be afraid you couldn't get a job if you had one on your wrist. Yeah. You know, now, like, sleeves are would, prominent I everywhere. would not be surprised if in our future we have a president with a face. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> he, it just says fucking It says like his mom's name under his eye <laughs> It's like Lucy under his eye He has a couple tattoo tears I can change the country for you No, no It says uh, always tired under his eye no. Dude what the fuck happened to Post Malone though I haven't heard anything about him in a long time Did he like drop uh, off the earth He released a hit album that was on the billboard Top one uh, Top 100 to play, for like You, you know Three months four months and then he was like, I'm going on vacation or tour, most likely. He's probably on tour. Oh, that's true, probably, I guess. But yeah, I haven't heard. And, but like, like I, the last things you heard, oh, Galladay, is he got in those two, he had those two Ooh. near death incidents, the accident and the plane thing. And then that was it. That was the last thing I heard about him. He was all over the place for yeah. a while. You know, he's out there enjoying his money. When you're on that, uh, that 
album run, you got to go promote your album. Oh, that's true, yeah. So it's been like a year touring, and then it'll take another year to put out an album. Well, usually they'll promote, and then they'll go on tour for the album, and then they'll take maybe like a year to half a year, I guess, somewhere in there, and then they'll pull out another album. Yeah, it makes sense. That makes sense, I guess. Yeah. So. It's a full-time job, though. Man. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. But you're rich, so. Well, right. Yeah, I mean, like, when you're on, you're you're busy all the time, because you're going on radio shows, you're going on TV, you're going on, bo- and you're just traveling, and I mean, yeah, it's, it's a it's like hard to say oh you poor me i'm staying in five star hotels and fucking you know but i mean it's like uh it's like being like a baseball player you work like baseball players make a zillion dollars but they when they on the on season i guess the regular season they're they're playing a baseball game 27 days a month yeah you know what i mean like that's a lot of work dude and they travel like from milwaukee to boston play three days fly to toronto play three days fly to oakland it's like you're constantly I hope you guys at home enjoyed our baby goth episode. Yeah, right. Baby goth and fucking little Zan and whatever. So but <laughs> Triple Dipple. Triple Dipple, but that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Don't look up baby goth. Don't please They're don't. gonna do it, Dude, they're, gonna, don't. They, they're gonna do it. Now they did it. We just we made her bigger. more famous. Oh my god. You did it. Our, yeah, it's your fault. <laughs> it was in my fault. It's your fault. <laughs> he Anyways, lie to your friends. Tell them it's worthwhile. All that shit. But for Jonas, baby goth, call me. For TNT Dynamite. Oh Jesus, we are out. <laughs>